how's everybody doing? Thank you for chiming in the House of Truth. All general messages may not resonate, but if you would like a personal soul session, feel free to email me at azarabeintuitive at gmail.com. And I will be happy to assist you with a reading, or you can Google House of Truth. Leave me a message. I'll get back with you in a 24-hour period. I pray that everybody's okay, keeping safe, staying protected. It's vital you keep up on your prayers and or meditations to build your own personal relationship with God. Having faith is the number one key. Clear. I want to go ahead and get a general card for this reading. General energy. Getting a general energy for this reading. Holy Spirit. Calling in the energy of the collectives. 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 in the energy of the collective soul and spirit. We got a uh, opening heart, deep connections, water blessings. Okay, we have ele number 11, balance. What's behind that? Sensuality in reverse. <laughs> okay, so we got opening the heart here. So you could be healing from some things, past relationships, past uh, situations, adversities, you know, whatever the case may be. Balance is coming into your life, emotional balance. Okay, uh, so it's like you're finding grounding. You're grounding here. Are you grounded? Okay, opening heart, your heart chakra is activated. You got a deep connection with someone here. We have water blessings. A lot of people, uh, I've never dealt with it, but believe in water spirits. Okay, yes, they are real. <laughs> Calling in the energy of the collective. Something's going on with a deep connection that you're dealing with. Calling in the energy of the collectives. It's starting off as beautiful energy. Yeah, you're healing here with the three of swords in reverse. Okay, you could be healing from a broken heart. Getting ready to take some type of action here. So, there's some healing. That's what's up with the hangman in reverse. Hang, um, hangman uh, in reverse is about taking some type of, taking some type of action. Healing from a broken heart. Okay, your heart, okay, and this could be that your uh, heart chakra is activating through some type of emotional type of communication, take it as it resonate. okay, calling in the energy of the collectives, manifesting a new beginning with the magician card, okay, somebody has all the tools available in order to start a new beginning here, okay. And then we have page of swords in reverse. Someone's not really communicating uh, their feelings here. Okay. Swords is about, you know, feelings. And it could be that someone is healed or they're healing. Okay. Through this deep connection. Okay. Calling in the energy of the collectors. Healing from a broken heart. Somebody... Did, did you wrong? Did you dirty? Stabbed you? I don't want to say, well, same thing. I felt stabbed, stabbed you in the back. Clarify this three of swords in reverse. Clarify this three of swords in reverse. You're healing from this. Taking actions here. Clarify the three of swords in reverse. And this is about holding on. This is the four... Four of Pentacles here fell on the side. At times you wanted to let go or whatever you were dealing with. Maybe they wanted to let you go. Take it as it resonate here. Trying to find the strength with strength fell out on the side too as well. Clarify the hanging man in reverse. 
clarify the hangman in reverse. Someone's getting ready to take some type of action here. Hangman in reverse. Having this open heart connection. That's beautiful energy. Opening the heart through uh, communication here. Very emotional type of communication. Okay. Or it could be uh, some type of like uh, uh, emotional connection that you have. Here you're taking action here when it comes to nurturing. You're coming out as the empress. That's beautiful energy here. Holding on uh, from, a, from going through something tumultuous, something that hurt you. Finding the space to be able to still love and be open is what I'm seeing. Releasing toxicity with the devil in reverse. Releasing codependencies, whatever the case may be. Okay, there's some things that could have... <coughs> there's some things that are healing within you. The Ace of Wands here, okay, that came out. That's, uh, a lot of wands came out in this last reading here. We want to manifest a new beginning here. This could be you, Collective, or someone that you're dealing with, okay, Noticing that you are opening your heart back up here and finding balance through communication. Okay, you are very, uh, very emotional. Like you, uh, I see the Queen of Cups, like wearing your heart on your sleeve, you know. Somebody could also be a, <laughs> a big ball of water, you know, very sensitive, you know. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Okay, so someone, because of the fact that someone is healing uh, past hurt and pain, uh, I don't know, maybe someone feels like there's no need to really communicate their feelings here. The king of wands. You got the king of wands here. Very handsome. Could be a Leo's Aries Sag. Take it as it resonates. Okay. And we got the Nine of Wands, which is the Wounded Warrior. Someone's really been through a lot here. Okay. It could have been through uh, mental anguish, going through something mentally too as well. Okay. But this King of Wands is standing within, their, within he or she's power here, even though they've been through a lot. Can we clarify? Can we clarify the four pinnacles? Someone's trying to hold on. Someone could be trying to hold on to you, collective. Clarify the four pinnacles on the side. Four pinnacles. Clarify the four pinnacles. It's clarified with the hermit card. Someone was trying to hold on here. Um, the hermit is like withdrawing oneself, right? In the upright, the hermit is about spiritual teachings, and when it's in the reverse, it's like someone who's isolating themselves, withdrawing themselves, anti-sociable, right? You got the tower card. There was some type of breakdown here, okay? Uh, some type of loss, upheaval here with the tower card. I feel like someone withholding themselves or being in this energy of, you know, it could be anti-sociable, um, not really wanting to, because that's the hermit in reverse, not, not allowing yourself to be guided, but you're in seclusion, right? Secluding yourself, withdrawing yourself, and with this type of energy, it brought, a, it brought about an a upheaval here, some type of tower moment. Someone's uh, experienced a tower moment through. Uh, it's almost like feeling like someone ended up losing themselves in some type of situation. Okay, or some type of adversity. Okay. Masks are falling off. Take it as a resume. Clarify the devil in reverse. Releasing toxicity. Clarify the devil in reverse. Clarify the devil in reverse. Clarify the devil in reverse. Devil in reverse is clarified with the hereford and the two of swords. This is about conforming. Okay, con yeah, conforming. 
the Hierophant is about some uh, higher teachings, higher learning, right? Okay. Someone could also be married. Take it as a resignate. Could be a religious leader too as well. Releasing toxicity here. Someone's releasing toxicity within some type of connection. Like I said, I... Yeah. With the hair fit. And then the two of swords. Someone is blocking themselves. Or they're on guard. Someone could be guarded because they could be a religious leader. Or someone could be, you know, on guard here because they're they're in another connection. Take it as it resonates. But this is a form like blocking, guarding. Okay, you got no you have full uh, blinders on, you can't see someone could be blocked. Okay, wanting to take action here with the uh, hangman when it comes to this nurturing and loving individual, releasing toxicity. Letting go of conformity, sorry, letting go of conformity. But at the same time, someone could be guarded with the two of swords. Someone's releasing conformity. Okay. It's like uh, control is what I'm feeling. Yeah, it's like releasing control of something here with the hair fit. Like I said, somebody could be in a relationship. This could be a religious leader. Okay, this is, could be someone higher learning, higher teachings. Someone could, uh, like someone has a maybe a platform or someone is some type of teacher. Take it as a resume. Okay, but at the same time, someone is still on guard and releasing the control of trying to get someone to conform. Clarify the magician card. I think that's really trying. Someone's trying to manifest a new beginning. Clarify the magician. Clarify the magician. It's, the magician is clarified with uh, the six of pentacles. Okay. Someone, someone is trying to manifest someone because the Six of Pentacles is about generosity, giving, but it in reverse is someone who takes. So someone's trying to manifest someone giving something here with the Ace of Wands. Like, clarify Ace of Wands. Somebody is trying, is using their magic, but it's in a good way. The star. They look at you as a wish fulfillment. Clarify with the Ace of Wands. Clarify this uh, Ace of Wands. Clarify the Ace of Wands. Clarify the Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is clarified with. It says the four of wands in reverse. Someone's trying to manifest a new beginning. Ace of wands. Put that off to the side. Clarify the ace of wands. There's something about an unhappy community. Because someone is the wish fulfillment. Clarify this ace of wands. Clarify this ace of wands. Ace of Wands is clarified with the Page of Pentacles, starting a new foundation. Someone has this been given this creative spark. This is the authority hand of God. Like someone has been given this creative spark here, wanting to start a new foundation, something new, with this someone who's a wish fulfillment, and this community is not happy about it. Clarify the Four of Wands in reverse. Clarify the four wands in reverse. Clarify the four wands in reverse. Okay, clarify the four 
clarify this four of wands in reverse. Uh, also, side note, when it comes to the twin flame journey, someone's uh, either stressed or tired, don't have the strength, something to that effect. They're taking a rest or taking a break from, this, from the journey. It might be the reason why you're not in contact with them. Four of Wands is clarified with the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Someone's not happy in regards of this. Yeah, like I said, someone could be in another relationship or connection. So that means that whoever, Lord, that means somebody knows about someone else with this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Clarify the Page of Swords in reverse. Someone's not communicating their feelings, like probably getting over something. Clarify this page of swords in reverse, Holy Spirit. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Page of swords is clarified with the Knight of Cups not moving forward, making any type of offer. So this is like someone... Uh, communicating their feelings, you know, in regards of, you know, making some type of offer here. Clarify this King of Wands. King of Wands, very handsome, standing in his power. Leo Aries Sag. King of Wands. Clarify this King of Wands. This King of Wands. King of Wands is clarified with the Ten of Swords in reverse. Okay. Someone could always could I said always. Someone could be healing too as well from being stabbed in the back. Clarify this Ten of Swords. I said Ten of Wands. Ten of Swords in reverse. Someone's healing from something that has been tumultuous. Clarify this Ten of Swords. Clarify this Ten of Swords in reverse. The Wounded Warrior. Ten of Swords. Somebody at the door? No. Clarify the Ten of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. Someone is healing here. But it's the Ten of Swords in reverse. Clarified with the Ace of Pentacles. Someone could be healing. Like, because they don't want to miss out on this opportunity. Or they don't no longer want to continue some type of behavior. This uh, King of Wands don't. Clarify this Nine of Cups in reverse. Don't want someone to walk away. What I feel is like someone's wanting to change some type of action or some type of behavior. Clarify this Nine of Cups in reverse. Not moving forward, making an offer. Clarify this Nine of Cups in reverse. So there's some type of stagnation when it comes to movement and someone offering their cup. Clarify this Nine of Cups in reverse. It's clarified with the Queen of Swords. King of Wands and the Queen of Swords. Someone's scared that they might be rejected. This is the reason why they're not moving forward with the Nine of Wands in reverse. With any ideas or plans. Because they someone's scared of their plans and ideas being rejected. And this King of Wands here. Looking at something as an opportunity or a blessing here. Clarify this King of Wands. Or clarify this uh, Ten of Swords. Clarify the Ten of Swords. Oh, that's too many. Clarify the Ten of Swords. In reverse. Ten of Swords in reverse. Holy Spirit. Ten of Swords in reverse. Not making a choice. Yeah. It's like somebody who don't want to be hurtful in a certain situation. Maybe because someone has already been through. A tumultuous time with uh, maybe, you know, partnerships, relationships, friendships here. Because you got the star that's 
uh, the wounded warrior here. And you got a queen of pentacles in reverse who's not happy. In re uh, yeah, they're not happy due to this king making a, some type of choice or a decision. Clarify the queen of pentacles. This could be a mother, sister. Clarify the queen of pentacles in reverse. Could be the other person. Queen of pentacles in reverse. Queen of pentacles in reverse. Is feel like they've lost someone and maybe lost this hair fit. Okay. Clarify the four of wands in reverse. Clarify the four of wands in reverse. Wow. Wow. <laughs> four of wands in reverse. The ace of swords. I think it was in reverse. Clarify this four of wands. Clarify this four of wands. In reverse for the collective four wands in reverse, not nurturing. <coughs> Someone's camp. It's a happy, uh, unhappy community because someone's not able to enjoy the fruits of one's labor, right? Wanting to move forward. There's some type of communication here about moving forward due to deceit, lies, or something is going on here behind the scenes. Someone sneaking around. It could be this hair fit. Take it as it resonates. This uh, King of Wands, very handsome, very beautiful, whatever the case may be, male or female, remember their energies are fluent, uh, very handsome, very beautiful. They're sneaking around with a wish fulfillment, the star here, and, and what I feel is like this other person here, this karmic, this queen of pinnacles in reverse, they know about it, or know about their person sneaking around with their wish fulfillment, the person that they want to be with. Clarify the seven of swords. So there was some type of communication here that someone is planning on moving forward because of this. Clarify. Clarify the seven of swords. Clarify the seven of swords. Someone could be uh, spying on someone else. Clarify the seven of swords. Clarify the seven of swords. Seven of Swords, yeah, looking at the Wheel of Fortune, someone is getting ready to turn, something's getting ready to turn in someone's favor due to someone's actions, <laughs> oh my God, it's like uh, being, being caught cheating, right, or sneaking around, and it causes someone to move forward, and somebody's like, yeah, that's what I want, bust it, you caught me, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> like wow like you wanted me to leave anyway like you just just say it you don't have to do all of this just say you want me to go <laughs> clarify this hair fit clarify this hair fit like just go clarify the hair fit busted you can pack your bags now <laughs> clarify the hair fit that's the vibe that I'm getting. Clarify this hair fit. Not happy. The sun in reverse. The hair fit's not happy. Wanting somebody to move. Like, you got me. You caught me. Now when you're leaving. <laughs> like, wow. Really? <clears throat> I want you to leave now. Clarify the, the chariot. I'm about to go. Clarify the chariot. <laughs> wow. Somebody, yeah. Tower card. Everything. The chariot card. Moving forward. But it's the five of wands in reverse. Clarify this chariot. Clarify the chariot. Someone's communicating that they're going to move forward if maybe something don't cease, stop. I don't stop sneaking around. Clarify this chariot. Clarify the chariot. Clarify the chariot. Chariot is clarified with Ace of Swords. Peace and victory. Like I said, I'm busted. You caught me when you leave it. <laughs> Clarify this Wheel of Fortune. They're like, you sneaking around. Somebody sneaking around is going to cause 
the wheel to turn is to so, turn in someone's favor. This could be Aries, Leo, Sag. Not moving away to calmer waters. Clarify this. Uh, what time is it? Clarify the wheel of fortune. Oh, it's okay. Because of someone leaving, it's causing someone else to stay. This person catches maybe this hierophant, king of wands, sneaking around, which is going to cause something here. It's gonna, something's going to turn in someone's favor. Not putting any work, not looking. This is like an investment. It's not investing and moving away. It's like, yeah. Someone's not enjoying the fruits of their labor. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Holy Spirit, clarify the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Justice. This could be a divorce. Justice is going to be served. Three of Pentacles is about teamwork, working together. Somebody feels maybe something is justified. Clarify this nine of pentacles in reverse. Nine of pentacles in reverse. Damn. Not enjoying the fruits of one labors with the three of wands in reverse. Yeah, this is like somebody picking up, moving, and going elsewhere, right, with the wands. I have an idea. I didn't finish these projects. I'm getting ready to move on to something else. Yeah, somebody's not, and this is what somebody wants. This is what somebody wants. And I want you to go <laughs> clarify the three of pentacles. Lord have mercy. Clarify the three of pentacles. The king of swords. Not standing in their power when it comes to somebody coming together and working together. This is the reason why somebody is not enjoying the fruits of one's labor. Clarify this, uh, King of Swords. Clarify this, King of Swords. Somebody's not waiting here. Uh, not feeling replenished, not feeling, you know... The well is about waiting, replenishing it, you know. The King of Swords. Clarify the well. It's like someone not cutting something off. Judgment. Wanting to leave the past in the past. It's King of Swords. Not being, not cutting something off. Judgment in reverse. Clarify the well. Temperance. There's an earth angel in the picture here. Someone's needing replenishing by this earth angel. Judgment, which would be the star too. Clarify judgment one more time. Holy Spirit in reverse. Judgment in reverse. Uh, the car is what's... Okay. Someone's having anxiety, stress, can't sleep, nine of swords. Because someone is finding some type of uh, support, nurturing, love, replenishing uh, from this star slash... From this star slash uh, temperance. Clarify this nine of swords. There we go. Clarify the nine of swords. Clarify the nine of swords. Damn. Yeah, somebody's upset because someone is not acting hasty, being hasty in their actions. Clarify this nine of swords. It's like. 
somebody wants someone to do the most by cutting something out here, but they're not doing it. Somebody does not want another person to walk away. This is the star. This could be a religious leader, teacher, whatever the case may be. Somebody who's married, but someone is not wanting to conform or not wanting to control a certain situation anymore. Kind of like letting things fall, or as my grandma say, let the chips fall where they may. Nine of Swords is clarified with, yeah, someone's hiding themselves in their work and, and creating with the Nine of Pentacles, moving forward and creating a foundation elsewhere. At the bottom of the deck, there's death, an ending, transformation, new beginning, leaving the past in the past. Yeah, leaving this queen of cups here, tired of going back and forth. Somebody taking this leap of faith because they're not happy at home, at home. wanting this ace of cups. Wanting to embark upon uh, this blessing here, this opportunity. There's some type of communication of feelings here with the two of cups in reverse. This will be Leo, Aries, Sag, once again. Water sign, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Clarify the two of cups in reverse. Somebody's in a, a not-so-happy connection with the two of cups in reverse. And it's causing someone anxiety. Damn. Yeah, because they don't want somebody to walk away. Clarify this two of cups in reverse. I got to go. Two of cups in reverse. I'll try to come back out with a couple more videos. Two of cups in reverse. Clarify this two of cups in reverse. Oh, wow. That's too many. Two of cups in reverse. The King of Cups, very loving. Where, um, yeah, somebody's looking at this Hereford as a King of Cups, and they don't want them to move away, even though they're in a, yeah, situation, taking a rest and a break from uh, someone here. Okay, but somebody's got an open heart. Yeah, what I want to do is kind of clarify this uh, open heart real quick. Let me clarify open heart, Holy Spirit. Let me clarify open heart. Having an open heart. Heart chakra is activated. Wow, really? Yeah, look at that. Ace of Cups. Somebody wants that opportunity. They want to embark upon that Ace of Cups. That's been your reading. I hope that it resonates in some shape, form, or fashion. Thank you for chiming in. Now it's the truth. Okay. Please don't forget to hit the like, share, subscribe button. That's the way to get my messages out. Please, let's take care of ourselves before we try to take care of each other. That's been your message.